Vivian's R1S and R1T have gotten their fair share of praise from owners and reviewers alike, but the starting prices make them anything but affordable. The company knows this well, but it was simply made to make them any stress to understand that we made an unfinished me not price. We've pretty much had that in four step. We put more intended in the New York in front papers uh, that, that we have now just uh, again. So uh, again, it took the wrong family up to a sentence of persistent sitting as a, a side territory of learning. It looks like Rivian is planning on announcing the R2 at an event on March 7th in the Laguna Beach, California. The company hasn't officially revealed the date, but a military has filed for an approval with Laguna Beach City Council to use a public beach area near its flagship store the afternoon of March 7. As part of the AT filing, a document showing Rivian's intended use of a grassy area was titled Rivian R2 Launch. Uh, interestingly, the company has since withdrawn the request following some opposition from locals. But that doesn't mean the event is canceled. Rivian can just use its flagship store which used to be a theater and still has an event space complete with a stage and screen, as it doesn't need any permission for that since it owns all Oakleys. The outside space was intended to showcase six vehicles, which, again, can also be done inside, so this is far from official or confirmed, but uh, it is looking incredibly likely that we'll see the R2 making its debut tomorrow. The new model is expected to be built at Rivian's new factory in Atlanta, Georgia, which should become operational later this year. The R2 deliveries might start in 2025. Um, however,